Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Monica Talk Cyber. If you haven't subscribed, do it right away. I come up with new videos on cybersecurity, leadership, career challenges. If you want to break into cybersecurity or if you're an aspiring CISO, I have also my CISO series that is coming out soon. It's going to be live streamed, so you will be a part of it. So subscribe right away and enjoy the journey. Today, I wanted to talk about mental health. It's World Mental Health Day today. Yeah. It's World Mental Health Day today. <laughs> There's something I wanted to share about my journey and about my life that I haven't told many people, but I believe it's kind of important that we're able to be open about it and transparent about it and share these kind of challenges in our lives because I'm pretty sure many of us face this. Many of us, both in cybersecurity and in society. So in whole transparency i wanted to share some moments of my journey with you and hope that this can bring some inspiration and some hope in your life as well there have been times in my life in the last decade or two where i've been broken completely and i've had to rebuild myself i have had massive self-doubt imposter syndrome and i've been through times in my life where i've not really loved myself or cared for myself and even though i training and I've always been very really physically active and taking care of my physical health I, there have been times where I really not focus on my mental health and we know that cybersecurity industry can at times be really toxic and we kind of like really need to give some time to ourselves and I've not really been that great at doing it for myself either and I've learned over the last few years, especially few months and few years, that how important is the mental health and the mindset, how important it is to love for yourself, um, to have love for yourself and to care for yourself, to be able to actually do that for others around you. If you're not empathetic towards yourself, you can't be really empathetic towards other people. So if there is one message that I want to give today and that I want to spread today and even if I can touch just one person that would be fantastic and that's don't wait to be kind to yourself loving yourself uh, showing empathy towards yourself being kind to yourself starts today and only so you can actually spread empathy and happiness and kindness to people around you so you have all heard charity begins at home start with yourself and show empathy and kindness towards yourself. You all deserve it. That's what I wanted to share today. I wish you all a happy World Mental Health Day and I hope that we can focus more and more on mental health and we can talk more about it and really lift each other up in this industry and this society. Take care everyone, that's all for today. This is Monica and I'll be talking to you very soon.